it is always very uh, interesting to see the vegetable team in their ideating phase while they are uh, thinking of some new product or new design or a, probably a gift, a seasonal gifts, new year gifts or Diwali gifts. Always amazing to go in their room and see them. They are always crippling on their sketches, uh, writing down or having some uh, you know, you know, markers in their hands and sketch, making sketches on a whiteboard. It's a completely different aura in their room whenever you go there. You can clearly see their love for mesh and their vision to make mesh as a uh, furniture material. It clearly depends. Meshable team, the, we call ourselves the Meshable Lab because uh, it's like a laboratory of ideas and you know we experiment. So this is one incident that I remember. It's not an incident, it's a it's an event that uh, we planned which was around, uh, it was a focus group where we called a lot of creative people and we asked them to you know, experience our products in space and we spoke to them as a team, we told them about the products and they gave us feedback and told us truly what they feel about the products and I think that experience as a lab, it was amazing because it was like a true experiment you know, happening you know, live experiment happened. Uh, the unique comment coming from the uh, the customer is about the modularity, how it is easily assembled, and uh, they see the wow. Okay, once they understand the modularity part, they see the wow in it. Usually, most of the customers are amazed by it. Like they see it and they, they find it very unique. They haven't seen, you know, even mesh much. Uh, and they, they find it very exciting because uh, a lot of them tell us that, oh, you know, it's modular. Oh, you can change it. So the first reactions of the customers are always, okay, wow, what do you think? Kids passing by our display in exhibitions, they got kids so excited, they see something new. Uh, so that, that's wonderful because if you are able to attract kids, then that's definitely a this kid in each one of us. Uh, for the customers who are actually genuinely interested to buy, I think general reactions are, they definitely find it unique, novel. And uh, the if, if we are trying to decode it further, the uniqueness and the aesthetics is coming from the well mesh as a material, which like the options, these options are very new. They are always pleased with the aesthetics, the design appeal of things, uh, especially modularity product. Ke mein, to can, you know, reconfigure the product in their own way. So, wo bahut appeal karta. Functional way, we start to think about how much weight we can take, how much space we can take, how much space we can take, how much space we can take. The main question that they ask is, how much weight it can take. Okay, it seems too fragile, mesh as a material seems too fragile. But then we tell them that it can take 25 kgs of weight and 50 kgs of weight. They are clearly mind blown. Pure joy. Pure. Those, those are the moments for which designers sleep. Like to see and hold the future in their own hand and experience it before you introduce it to the world. Yeah, I think those are the we do a lot of ideas on paper and sometimes you know, uh, we make a prototype of all of the ideas that are there and we are very gungo about this one prototype and we are like this is the best product and you know wow you know this is, this is going to be really good. When I saw the products first time I was really like okay this is really interesting the concept was something else and the product is completely different when you see it. I mean, you have never seen anything like it and you probably not in the coming future, uh, probably 5 to 6 years because these are completely out of the box products, out of the box designs that you come up with. You can, modularity is a key aspect which people don't really easily understand and once they, they'll understand, once they see it, that's why once I saw the products, I was like, mind blown. So there's a wow and uniqueness. I guess Kingle, it has a certain character, certain geometry. It has its own beauty in itself. Apart from that, I, am, uh, I also like Dal I mean, uh, I will uh, go with Marmelos. Marmelos, when it started uh, uh, with sketches and all, it was all very 
very rack kind of configuration to start with. When we started actually playing more with it, more and more with it, and now that we are we are coming seeing that product with many possibilities that how we can put it in staggered configuration, we can put it in. I am much more going towards that functionality part for liking that product. Grandness. Uh, have you seen how many variations you can make of Grandness? You can keep, you take a set of six, you can you can keep all those six modules differently, you can combine two, two, two modules, you can combine three modules and create a separate product out of itself. I mean not a single product, maybe two products out of three modules. And when you have a set of six, imagine what you can do with your space.